Hello, hello, hello. Oh, I got the flu. Uh, anyway, just want to show you what I made. This is for bending a uh, plastic. Like this, a uh, oh, one eighth inch, um, oh, one eighth size um, acrylic glass. <laughs> It's very basic, it's just wood. I just found out that wood is very expensive. Damn it. And what you have here is a heating coil, which basically came from uh, a hair dryer. It's what's inside the hair dryer. What makes it heat up. Now, in the middle, I don't know if you can see this trip. This strip is like asbestos. It's heat resistant. I, the guy was nice enough to sell me the uh, the coil with the asbestos or whatever you call it. I forgot its name. There's a term for it. That sheet. He sold it together. I said I needed like two feet. So he cut two feet. By the way, you cannot you cannot cut it with a scissor. This thing breaks. So you have to slowly cut it with a uh, what do you call this? A saw. Which I can't find. Here. You cut it with this. Now, okay. I've secured it with two screws from end to end. By the way, um, in the Philippines, the voltage is 220. So make sure when you get a uh, coil, it's uh, it's built for 220 voltage coils. Some of them are 110, so they actually easily break. Now, here's my wire. This is my bug. Just wire. Both of them two wires and when you plug it you're gonna see it I don't know if you see it here somewhere in the dark and it's glowing I don't have a sh switch yet planning to make one but since this is like a temporary fix I just want to make sure it works I don't know if you can see it glowing red hot. Yeah. I think that's a good distance. But yeah, uh, look at the plastic if it starts bending. Just the time you can actually burn it. Ooh, smoking. We got fire. <laughs> fire. It's fairly new, so it's things are sparking up. Okay, now this is hot. Let me turn it off. I might have, I might need to uh, just hold it for a while. I might need to. Uh, I need this. What do you call this? A regulator. That's easy to make. I uh, just a. Uh, Unhook this one. Or not unhook it, but cut the wire up, put the regular in between so I can control it. Maybe put a switch here or something. But like I said, I just finished this thing today. As you can see, huh? Works like a dream. But I overcooked it because I kept talking. See, that's a, that's a sign of overcooking the, the plastic. So make sure next time when you do that, regulate the, the heat. <laughs> I basically got fire going on here. Anyway, um, yeah. I might coat this with something. You know, uh, it's a temporary thing, but you know, it's 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 good to it's good to know that it actually works uh, see 
We can try that again. It's fun. This shit is fun. Oh yeah. Make sure when you start bending, put a marker on it or on where you're gonna bend, so you can easily align it on top to concentrate the heat on where you wanna bend it. Right? Let's try that again. Get in. Let's see it burn. Red hot. Red hot. See, it starts getting hot. You can see the. You can see the plastic, basically just. Uh, you know, get the weight down. See, it's. See that it's starting to bend. I got flames. Look at that. That's good though. Okay, now she so keep doing this. So when you get the right, let me turn it off before I catch fire. <laughs> See, it's malleable enough. And hold that for a few seconds. Let's just hold the shape. Now, um, what I do, it's it's weird how I do stuff, you know, I don't, I don't really measure stuff, I mean, I do, <laughs> a little bit, but most of the work I do is visual, and, you know, I manage to keep it straight, well, you just have to, you just have to be careful with what you're doing, anyway, I want to see that catch fire again. It's so much fun. Well, my uh, asbestos thing is actually doing well. It's holding up. I think the distance is quite good. Oh, I know what's burning. It's the adhesive that I put under it, and basically the wood also. But yeah, it's you're not gonna use it for a long time. I mean, you do it one at a time. So it's, uh, I might actually not need a need a regulator anymore. See, it? Oh, there it is. We're cooking. We're cooking. Ugh. Okay, turn it off. So actually might not need a regulator, just a, ooh, smoke. I'm just gonna need a switch, so I don't have to keep unplugging the, this thing. Just put a cutoff switch, oh god, it's built. That smoky barbecue thing. Uh, see, the wonders of what you can do to it. Uh, next time I'm gonna show you I'm gonna make a visor for a bike and I'm gonna show you how to use it how to use this thing and make wonders out of it the plastic is such a great thing not for the not for the environment but <laughs> for other stuff yep see good shit it's still warm okay uh, next time I'll make this more sophisticated than it is. Well, I just made it to prove a point. But I'll make it better. Um, switch, like I said. And it's climbing up. Okay. It's a good thing you test shit because, um, you know, it's easy to see what you're doing wrong or what you're doing right. Okay. Later. Life's here.